Is it true that Noah Schnapp has a deep-seated resentment towards Finn Wolfhard for bagging the role he wanted in Stranger Things? Well, find out in this video as we talk about 15 secrets about Noah Schnapp that nobody else knows. But first, a simple reminder on how to enter our brand new giveaway. We will be giving away either an iPhone X Max, the new iPad Mini, or a MacBook Pro. It's all your choice. So be sure to leave a like, comment the keyword, subscribe, and turn on notifications to enter the giveaway. It's really that simple. First is that Noah Schnapp is Jewish and had his bar mitzvah in Israel. Apparently, not a lot of people are aware of Noah's spiritual heritage, but he's actually quite proud of it. One time, a fan asked him on Twitter to choose between Mariah Carey's and Justin Bieber's Christmas albums. When he said neither, someone else immediately jumped to the conclusion that his Christmas caroler of choice is Michael Bublé. That's when the young actor corrected everyone and said he liked Adam Sandler's Hanukkah song best because he's Jewish. This is the same reason why even though he absolutely loves his role as Will Byers in Stranger Things, Noah feels that his role as Joe in a World War II drama resonates with him even more. In Waiting for Anya, Noah Schnapp plays Joe, a young shepherd boy in the French village of Lescun. Joe stumbled upon a Jewish man named Benjamin, who had successfully fled the Nazis, but lost his daughter Anya along the way. Together, the two connived to smuggle Jewish children across the border, all the way to Spain, where they'd be safe. Not too hard to see why Noah Schnapp signed up for this role, right? Next is that Noah Schnapp knows four languages. Even though Noah was born in New York, his family is actually from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Noah knows French, and back in 2016, fans started requesting him to upload videos of himself speaking French. Noah said he only knew two words. We now know that was a joke, since Schnapp has finally uploaded TikToks and YouTube videos where he actually speaks straight French for minutes. Sure, he sticks with basic phrases like, I love you, but there's nothing foreign about the way those words roll in his tongue. It's clear that he has that unique and adorable accent. Aside from English and French, the young Stranger Things actor has also been teaching himself Spanish and Portuguese. We have no idea why he wants to learn other languages, but we know his fans from all over the world really appreciate that Noah's trying to be closer to all of them, starting by speaking their languages. He's currently come a long way in his language classes from those childhood videos where Noah could be heard screaming, Arios, instead of Adios, while slamming the door to his bedroom. Did you know that Noah's first kiss was super awkward? Okay, this really isn't such a big secret since I have yet to encounter one person in the world who had a first kiss that wasn't awkward, but it's interesting to note that unlike the other Stranger Things kids, Noah didn't have his first kiss on the show. In fact, his character Will Byers hasn't even kissed anyone in the show just yet. That's completely understandable though, since Will Byers is still getting over all the trauma of getting stuck in the upside down all this time. He'll get there, but we do hope it will be more amazing than Noah's real life first kiss. So, in an Instagram Live, Noah narrated what happened. Apparently, he brought a girl home, and they started fooling around on this red couch at Noah's house. But while the action was just heating up, a light bulb fell off a nearby lamp, smashing into a million pieces on the floor. It's not like Noah's an expert at strange things or something, but that must have been a sign from Cupid. Next up, did you know that Noah has been acting since he was six? You've heard it countless times before. Stranger Things is Noah Schnapp's first and biggest break. Now, that's not entirely true since the young actor has actually been at it since he was six years old. Maybe Noah doesn't count this as part of his professional experience, but his history with school theater is actually a huge part of the actor he has become. See, it was his acting teacher that suggested he pursue acting professionally. That led to a lot of doors opening up for the young man, starting off with an off-camera gig that really put his name out there. I'm talking about the 2015 animated film, The Peanuts Movie. For those of you who don't know, Charlie Brown was voiced by Noah Schnapp. He has worked alongside Oscar winners Steven Spielberg and Tom Hanks in Bridge of Spies. Did you know that Noah Schnapp has cherophobia? Quick background, cherophobics are people who have an aversion to being too happy. Usually, this stems from a deep-seated belief that life is all about balance. So being too happy at one moment means the universe is going to reverse stuff and you'd be equally sad later on. This comes pretty close to one of Noah's greatest fears. A few years ago, this young man blew everyone's mind by suggesting that laughing may not be so great. He asked, Everyone says laughing is great, but what if you laugh so long you can't breathe and then you die? Hmm, not so good anymore. That's textbook cherophobia, but it's still not Noah's greatest fear. In an interview, Noah said he is still more worried about not being able to breathe underwater. Yep, drowning is his biggest fear. Next is that Noah Schnapp is a big fan of Roblox. In an interview with Wired, Noah revealed how big of a Roblox fan he really is. 
If you want to play with him, it shouldn't be too hard for you to find his profile since he revealed it in the same interview, despite worried warnings from Millie Bobby Brown that he shouldn't. We have no idea if Noah will continue using that username now that everybody knows it though, but it's definitely worth a try. Next is Noah Schnapp has a special friendship with Millie Bobby Brown's younger sister. You know who Noah loves playing Roblox with? That's none other than Ava Brown, Millie's younger sister. Noah has such a wonderful relationship with the Brown siblings, it's almost like he's part of the family too. So I guess those young women on Twitter hoping for a chance to be Noah's wife should lay off for at least a few years, since the actor clearly still considers himself a child who loves to play Roblox with his young friends. Next, did you know Noah Schnapp is impressed with Millie Bobby Brown? Despite Noah's playful friendship with Ava, his main best friend is still his Stranger Things co-star Millie Bobby Brown. Surprisingly, even though the two barely have any scenes together in the series, they were able to forge a strong and close bond from day one. It got to a point where their fans just can't believe that the two are not dating. But trust me, it's all platonic between the two. They just have a really beautiful friendship that's rare to see between people of opposite genders. But the fact that they're really close friends never stopped Noah from being impressed by Millie. In an Instagram post, Noah said he can't imagine having a day in his life when he's not impressed by his best friend. Did you know that Noah Schnapp is a twin? You might be wondering how Noah is able to have such close relationships with girls his age when other boys his age get caught up in all kinds of awkwardness every time they try to be friends with young ladies. Well, let's just say Noah has never gone a day without a girl by his side. How's that, you ask? Noah was actually born with a twin sister, a beautiful young girl named Chloe. So yes, he's practically immune to the sheer awkwardness of navigating the opposite sex. Next is the fact that Noah Schnapp is a millionaire. It's pretty hard to come up with a precise estimate of how much an actor is really worth, but frankly, it shouldn't surprise anyone that the average estimate for Noah's net worth is now at a million dollars. He's been doing a lot of gigs for someone his age, and of course, he still doesn't have any bills to pay on his own. Plus, if we know anything about Hollywood, Noah still has years and years of fame in front of him, so he should be able to rake in more and more millions as time goes by. Next is that Noah Schnapp is pretty courageous. Not that we've ever had any doubts, but Noah Schnapp has proven time and again that he's quote and unquote pretty courageous. In an Instagram video he posted from a vacation in Anguilla, he revealed that the family went to a cliff where LeBron James himself once jumped off. But Noah's family was too scared to take the plunge, so he went alone all by himself and ladies and gentlemen, that is one courageous jump. Did you know that Noah Schnapp originally wanted the role of Mike Wheeler? Now, over the years, rumors have circulated that Noah and Finn Wolfhard have never been close, and it could be because Finn landed the role that Noah wanted for himself originally. This all stemmed from a pretty shady tweet that Noah posted a while back. He revealed that he auditioned for the role of Mike Wheeler and was surprised to receive a callback for the role of Will Byers. He said the main reason was that Finn was too perfect for the role, that he never had the chance. But Noah had already cleared things up regarding this matter, saying there's no hard feelings since he's also fallen in love with the role he got. Speaking of the role he got, did you know Noah Schnapp said he doesn't care to find out Will Byers' sexuality? One of the recurring themes of Stranger Things is the mystery revolving around Will's gender identity. There have been a lot of insinuations that the character might be gay, but we haven't gotten any confirmation so far. For Noah though, a confirmation is not really necessary. He thinks the character is so much more and has a lot more to offer than what might be suggested by whatever his gender identity could be. Next is the fact that Noah Schnapp is under a lot of fire for not speaking up about the current protests. Given the huge platform and popularity he has, people have been expecting a lot of political awareness from Noah. The fact that he's friends with Caleb and still hasn't said much about the BLM movement other than a 24-hour story sympathizing with looters is not sitting well with a lot of fans. Another thing that did not sit well with fans is Noah helping lovely peaches. Now, don't feel like a freak just because you haven't heard this story before. Noah's doing a pretty awesome job keeping his shameful experience a secret. Everyone knows Peaches the TikToker who entered another YouTuber's home uninvited and flashed while in a video call with the same YouTuber. I'm in the back because security kept passing by. Dude, you need to get away from Molly, bro. <laughs> bro, bro, how did you even get the address? Um, on the internet, I got it from Bad Baby. Despite the problematic behavior, Noah Schnapp decided it would be nice to help her out with the homelessness situation by donating money to her. Not the smartest move on the actor's part, so now he's doing everything he can to bury this secret. So now you know some pretty crazy and dark secrets about Noah Schnapp. If you love the Stranger Things cast and everything else related to them, make sure to check out the other videos we have on our channel. Thanks for watching.